Hey everybody! I'm here today to show you and tell you how to make your laptop faster. I'll be going over seven easy ways that you can make your laptop a lot faster than it currently is. Let's get right into the video. And often with a lot of these ways, you won't even have to do anything intense. With uh, many of these, it's just an easy quick fix. With some of them, it's a little bit more intense. Some of them cost money. Some of them are free. So you can choose whichever ones you want to take advantage of. Number one, close the programs that you're not using. Okay. Now the programs that you are, that are running, whether you're using them or they're in the background, they're going to draw power from the laptop. They're going to draw memory from the laptop they're going to draw usage power from the laptop so if you close them especially the ones that are running in the background that you're not using there's going to be basically no negative downside to it because you're not using the programs anyways um but they're going to make your laptop faster because they're not going to be drawing anything from the laptop's power availability or speed availability number two stop unnecessary programs from running at startup okay now this is my wife's laptop she is uh you know not the greatest with her startup program. She's got like 40 programs that open up at the start. Every month, she tells me my computer's slow. Honey, can you help me out? I go on her laptop. I basically disable a whole bunch of programs at the startup. And all of a sudden, it's faster. So it works really well, especially if you have a lot of unnecessary programs running at the startup. Just stop them from running at the startup if you don't need them. If you don't need them to run at the startup or need them to run at all. And uninstall them if you don't need them in general. Okay. Number three, run disk cleanups regularly. So a disk cleanup is essentially something that you should be doing on your laptop or your computer on a somewhat regular basis every few months would probably be enough. Um, you want to look at how to do it separately. That's a whole separate tutorial, but make sure you're cleaning up any unnecessary files on your disk, um, any cache files, stuff like that, stuff that you don't need, files that you don't need, clean them up on the regular. If you need the file or if a program needs the file, that's a different story. But when you run a disk cleanup, you're going to get rid of files that basically are unnecessary at the end of the day. Number four, defragment your hard drive regularly. Now, I don't do this that often because I keep my hard drive really clean. I keep most of my stuff on portable USBs, portable uh, hard drives, external hard drives and stuff like that. And I keep those locked away in a safe, to be honest with you. So like all my stuff is secure, not on my laptop, because God forbid it gets stolen or something like that. Like there's nothing on it. This is my wife's laptop. She's got tons of pictures on here, essentially, and videos at the end of the day. When I defragment her hard drive, her laptop runs much faster. My dad, you know, I think back in the day was more of a concern. My dad used to do once a month and his computer when PCs were, were new would run much faster he would call it i'm defragging the hard drive he would call it so you know i know it works it depends if you need it i don't do mine often because i don't think i need it often but if you if you have lots of files on your laptop definitely defragment the hard drive regularly once every month once every couple months should be more than enough number five turn off unnecessary features your laptop might have built-in features um like a fingerprint ID scanner, for instance, it might have uh, something that is, I don't know, any features that are like advanced technology features, um, they actually, you know, they use up the, the availability of the speed of the laptop. So if the features are turned on, let's say the fingerprint scanner is just waiting for you to scan your finger, fingerprint to log in, then essentially at the end of the day, it's using some power and using some speed and your laptop's going to be slower. So turn off those features that you don't need. Okay. Number six, get rid of files you don't need. Files will slow down your laptop massively because your laptop has to manage those files even when you're not using them so if you have some 50 gigabyte video on there like my wife keeps our wedding video on here the whole thing it's like two and a half hours long okay like the, the edited wedding video super high quality i don't know as I, I i don't know how big it is maybe 30 40 gigabytes i think 40 was the number it was huge I put it on an external hard drive, we locked it away, and now just with that one file, our laptop is much faster just when I got rid of it. So essentially, get rid of files you don't need. Don't just keep them on your computer just to have them there. Get rid of them. Put them on an external hard drive, an external USB drive, an external uh, drive of some sort, or just get rid of them if you don't need them. Just delete them if you don't need them. Lastly is number seven, which is upgrade your RAM. Now your RAM essentially determines how much juggling your laptop can do. So it determines essentially how many tasks your laptop can handle at one time. By upgrading your RAM, your laptop can handle more tasks. So if you were to do the same number of tasks as you did before upgrading your RAM, your laptop would be able to actually do them much faster, okay? So it'd be able to do them faster um, for the same tasks. So with that being said, upgrading your RAM is an awesome thing to do. Definitely something to consider to make your laptop run faster. That's it. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.